Whoa! Are we ready? Yeah. You know, I just cleaned this truck. Huh? I cleaned this truck. You put your little fingerprints all over the... You cleaned it? Yeah, I didn't you vacuum. You must have thrown it all inside. I didn't vacuum the floor. I forgot to do that. That's the one thing I didn't do. Oh, shit. I'm tired. Me too. We got to go to Big Sandy and Tyler. Big Sandy. They ain't shit in Big Sandy. And they less than Tyler. Well... When I go to Big Sandy, what do we got? that's my Sprite from McDonald's. That was from my uh, breakfast. And it's still in the here? It's still cold. I still got a little bit in there. My throat, when it gets a little parched. Oh, I'm tired of hearing about your throat. Here comes the car. I'm calling your bluff. Uh, that ain't no bluff. With me in here. No, I'm going to Big Sandy, drop some stuff off, and then... I already told the coaches that I'll swing back through and pick you up on my way back from Tyler. And what do you mean, pick me up? Where do you think I'm going to be at? Uh, I'm going to drop you off at Big no, Sand. No, you ain't. And then I'll come back and pick you up. No, you ain't going to drop me off. Because no I got to get stuff done. Well, I, I got to get stuff done. I don't care. I said I ain't going to be dropped off. And the only way I can get it done... That's bullshit. Is leaving you at the football no, field. You're, you're I, look, I got you a whistle and a polo back yeah, there that uh -huh. you can put on. Yeah. A whistle and a polo. A whistle and a polo. 94 degrees. Feels like it's 104 outside. You're a job, you sleep good last night? Very, very good. Good. Did you? Yeah, I slept good. Till I'm not doing much as I fed you. No, as yeah. Huh? We didn't go anywhere yesterday. I thought we went somewhere. No. No, yesterday we went to uh, Kurt's Mausoleum. I tell you, it was hot out there, wasn't it? It was hot. It was hot. <laughs> it sure was. <sighs> now we got to go to Big Sandy Tyler, and then I'm going to come back. And I got to... I got to plant some stuff in my yard at home. I bought some Japanese maple trees that I got to plant. Why didn't you let Jace the Conner do it? Because. You plant them? I don't think so. I don't think so. No. I, you know, he don't need to be doing that kind of work. I told him, because he volunteered to help. And I said, no, Pop and I will get it done. No, you see that? You ain't volunteered me to get out there and dig around in the yard. The funny thing was I wasn't volunteering you. I know you wasn't. You think you're trying to tell me. Dad said he was... That ain't working. I well, I only have a left-handed shovel at home. Uh, and I'm not left-handed. Well. <sighs> I eat some french fries and a sausage egg and cheese mcgriddle from mcdonald's it was good was it it was good it gave how me enough energy just to do a little more work today how much did it cost me yeah. Yeah. uh between connor's happy meal and uh my food it was about 11 bucks yeah. hey. it gave me just enough energy to do some more today give a little extra effort. You know what I mean? I hear you. Whether they do any good or not, I don't know. People already at work over there. Yep. I had to get up this morning and work. I figured you were asleep. Shit, I've been up ever since 4 o'clock. No, I called Dan and she said you were still asleep in the bed. I don't care. Looking what, at the ceiling. I don't care what Nan said. I wasn't still asleep. Chairman. She said she had to get up and fix the coffee. Shit. And you know, I, I talked to her. She That'd said... That'd be the day. I talked to her and I said, you know, Nan, you need a break. You need a vacation. Let Pop start doing most of that work. And she said, Pop's been... She goes, Pop hasn't worked in 25, 30 years. He's been retired. And don't y'all forget it. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm tired of working. 
dad said you only worked a few years that's when a few he was years, growing up. That's your few years as. Dad said when he was old enough to when he was old enough to start walking home from school, you said, son, you gotta go to work, make some ends. And he said you just took the time off. And now, my, his mother never let him walk from school. Why not? No. I bet you never walked home from school either. Oh, shit, I bet you I did. I walked to school. And walked back from school. Rain, snow, and heat. Just any way. Barefoot? Barefooted. Didn't have no shoes. So how'd you get to school when it was raining and snowing? You, you didn't go barefoot then, did you? Yes, I did. You I did? Too. You just had to run a little faster? Yeah. Stay on the road where the cars... Would melt the snow? Yeah, I'd hitchhike. Hitchhike? Yeah. That's like this, with your thumb out. <laughs> you don't know nothing about stuff like that. No, I don't. I had a bicycle. <laughs> well, I was in mine. And Nan still wouldn't let me ride my bicycle to school when I was little. Or ride the bus. No. She had to take her baby to school. Yep. That's my text message coming over my little monitor there. Who is Brian Minton? My boss. Is that right? Yep. Does he know anything? Mm-hmm. When I read this text message, it's probably going to say, you and Pop are fired. Then he would be a creep. <laughs> I guarantee. <sighs> he would be up a creep. Then I wouldn't be able to pay you money no more, Pop. That money that I I'm stuffing in there. I ain't no that. money yet that you paid me, period. Because you you hadn't been taking your memory pill. I told you about taking that memory I pill. I have been taking it. You start taking it, you'll start feeling bad for me. Yeah. Huh? Yeah. You'll You're start right. feeling. You'll You're say, right. You're you know right. that might. You know maybe it's maybe you know I don't want to see you in a in a bad state oh. of mind. Because I know if you take that memory pill, you're going to remember all sorts of stuff you there owe me. You that you owe me. Then I what? And you and Dad need to share them, the memory pills. Yeah. Your dad does, not me. He don't know shit. Period. <sighs> He's getting ready for football season. Referee high school football. Yeah. He is. He's been so down. You get out there and talk. He's been out there walking around on the track trying to get in shape. Well, he can't do that. He can't get in shape. He's about like his son sitting there. His son? That belly. Nah. My belly doesn't look like that because I'm taller. Yeah. Where are all these people at? They should be out working in their yards. Look at that little old donkey. Pop, that's a horse, I think. It's a donkey out there with that horse. Oh, I didn't see the donkey. I told you the little horse. Well, maybe it was just a young horse. It, it was. No use trying to explain anything to you. <sighs> you cheer me? Yep. I can't wait till winter time, Pop. Me neither. I hate this hot weather. Me too. It feels better being able to wear a jacket and sit yeah. out on your front porch. There you go. You know? I hear you. And you can watch the women walk down the road all bundled up. Yeah. You know, I... I, I cheered you. Nan and Dad told me and once it gets a little colder, your bones are going to be aching a little bit. And your muscles and joints are going to be hurting. So it would probably be in, in your best interest. In your best interest to stay at home on that recliner. And I told them that was probably a good idea. They ain't told you shit. And Dad and, and Nan said, you know, we don't need to discuss anything with Pop. He'll just go along with it. <laughs> they... 
They really wished I would. Well, you know, like they say, whatever Dad says goes. Yeah, uh huh. That bull, Snooky. Dad said, as long as he's paying your newspaper bill, <laughs> you got to if you got to bend that, the knee. That boy belly. Shit. He said, you got to bend the knee. Jason. You kind of have to. Because you know what I'm telling you is the truth. Ain't no ain't no reason for me to lie. Four horses out there, boy. What Get are you going to be hungry for today? They ain't but mowed that grass yet. What are you gonna be hungry for today? I don't know. What are you? I I, I already ate. I'm kind of held over. Okay. If I start eating, I know you'll with you'll start eating too. No, Pop. I know you like the back of my hand, Pop, Jason. Pop. Why? Everything I do is for you, not me. Oh yeah, yeah. I take you to eat, and I just I don't sit there and watch you. Why my bell phone getting weaker? <laughs> I take you to go eat and I just sit there and watch. You should. Shit, I want to see that. I want to see that day. We don't have enough money for both of us, so I got to sacrifice and say, you, you know what? Sacrifice. Watch me eat. That's why we go to Mexican food restaurants so I can eat the free chips and hot sauce. Taking a nap over there on the corner of the road. Yeah. I need motor yard. You hear me? I hear you. At least they got a little bit of that yard mode. I don't know why you worry about other people's yards, and then I come well, over here. It looks silly. And then I come over to your house and I take care of yours. I want to see how long it's gonna take you to start lying about my yard. You don't do shit in my yard. You see, oh, uh, Donnelly's liquor right over there. They got mm -hmm. them Donnelly's liquor. They got them a new sign and everything. Yeah. You wanna they go? They've been selling a lot of. Liquor or dope one. <laughs> you wanna uh -huh. go? You wanna go in there and get some hooch? No, I don't drink hooch. You don't drink hooch? I don't drink it no more. Used to many, many, many years ago. <laughs> I am tired. Huh? I'm tired. You're tired. Well, pull over here and let me drive. I didn't say I wanted eternal sleep, Pop. I said I'm just tired for right now. Did you hear what I see? I heard what you said. I can't do that. All I need is for one of these Glade Water cops to pull you over, and you know what happens. They would say, "Hey, Joe, how you been doing?" <laughs> and then they, you know what they're gonna do? They gonna they're gonna do loosen that. up the back of this shirt right here. They ain't gonna do shit, not to me. When they pull you out of that truck. They're going to leave me alone. Yeah. They got better sense to pull me out. Uh -huh. They look at me, they look at my size, and then they look at you, and they know that they're going to pull you out all squirrely. Yeah. Assume the position is what they're going to tell you to do. Yeah. Donut shop's open. You want some donuts? No. They don't mow the side of the road. 
show sure looks bad. People who own it just don't do it. They don't. Uh, even the people who own the yard don't do it. You know it? I know it. Not everybody has I their... I used to have to do all this shit. Not everybody has their own free lawn care like you do. I know it. Keyword, free. Free. I get tired of doing free stuff for do everybody. You? For everybody. Do you? <clears throat> yep. Where are we going this way? This is the way we go to Big Sandy. Oh. Is that right? That's right. They buy houses back there. You ought to know because you're going to be left there. I'm on what? You're going to be left there. I ain't neither. You're full of doo-doo. <laughs>